guys, Mr. T Lexify back, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the massive and the biggest Little Lost Girl Easter egg, the final Easter egg, the biggest one for Black Ops 2 Apocalypse Origins. Now, basically, I did this, but unfortunately, after I finished this, I didn't record while I was doing the gameplay, and uh, it sort of fucked up. I went on theater, I had to do another download, and then finally, I'd go on my theater, and it says invalid file for all of you guys that are following me on Twitter. You'll know about it. Go follow me on Twitter for the latest updates about my channel. It's at Mr. T Lexify. Now, I want to thank the JFK Gamer and the Mystery Box HD for some great, great Easter egg gameplay that I've gotten. Thank you guys so much for giving me this after I've been through all this shit with Black Ops 2, guys. I swear the theater mode needs to be fixed. But without further ado, guys, let's get started with the video. Now, before I want you guys to start the video, basically, there's a couple of things that you're going to need to learn. They'll all be down in the description. I'll leave some pictures on the screen that you can just click and you need to learn how to make the ultimate staffs, how to get the thunder fist, and how to get the napalm airstrike. So that will all be in the description so go check that out before you watch this video. Now guys, I also forgot to mention that you're going to have to know how to build the Maxis drone. Again, I do have a video about that on my channel so just look at my channel for all the videos. You need to learn how to build the ultimate Ultimate staffs, the Maxis drone, the ultimate, uh, the lightning fist, and the napalm monkey bomb. Once you know that, go to the robot beside generator two or three, shoot his foot, go in, and make sure you have the ultimate lightning staff. Place that in the holder, and then once you have done that, basically go to the robot beside uh, the church. Get in him and basically put down the ultimate ice staff. Then go to the middle robot and place down the ultimate wind staff. Now the ultimate fire staff has it the easiest. He just basically goes down to where you build the staffs and places it there. Now once you're done that, you will get all these staffs back. Now I know a lot of people have been asking me if you can do this solo or two player. You cannot do it solo, but I think you can do it two player. Now basically the next step is you got to go into a robot. Now once you have gone into a robot, just basically uh, stay there and make sure a guy with the napalm... A monkey bomb throws it down beside stamina beside this white crater then get the guy in the robot to press the red button and this thing will explode now once you do that get the maxis drone in there and he will fly down there and he will just basically stay down there once he does that there will be eight panzer big soldats make sure you use your ultimate staff to destroy them you must kill all of them before you can go on the next step now the next step is you have to get a zombie blood preferably get the one and buy generator one if you haven't got that you will see a fiery plane just like when you build the fire staff Staff. now just shoot that down now after that you have to get a complete new and other uh, zombie blood and you will have to run around the excavation site and find a zombie only the person with zombie blood will be able to see it and basically he will drop the max drum pick that up now on to the next step basically what you have to do is you have to get your thunder fist make sure this is under round 19 because uh, once you do this it will take a while uh, it will take longer if this is over 19 because it's not a one hit and basically once you uh, you have to get all your upgrades for your lightning fist so for example um, if see it right here for the example ice fist this guy gets picks up a stone and now he has ice fist you have to make sure everyone gets the uh, staff of their according for their fists and then finally go to Argotha place down all your staffs in the holders and get a bunch of kills once you do that this thing will fill up with zombie souls and the sky will appear you will now be able to get to heaven and then finally if you want to end the game you will just have to place down the max drone and stand in that blue plate on the middle if you don't want to end the game that is fine you can pick up your staffs and proceed and yeah guys um that is basically how you get to heaven that is basically how you complete the easter egg guys so i do hope you guys enjoyed make sure you want to like favorite share make sure to subscribe guys really helps on my channel but anyways thank you one more time and i'll see you guys later